Witam wszystkich bardzo serdecznie z tej strony Sebastian, a Was moi drodzy zapraszam do trzeciego odcinka z The Invisible. Oczywiście tak jak poprzednio rozpoczniemy od komiksu, podsumowując nasze ostatnie, ostatnie wydarzenia. Ok, tu wygląda, że tu mamy kontynuację. Zwabiona dźwiękiem maszyn wierniczych, Jasna wchodzi na teren wykopalisk, ale nie spotyka tam nikogo. Jasna odnajduje Marit, ale jest już za późno na ratunek. Jasna natrafia na kolejnego członka załogi Kowala. Mężczyzna jest żywy, jednak pogrążony w takim samym stuporze co doktor Krauta. Jasna zanosi go do lądownika. Jasna uruchamia sądę wspólnoty, która od tej chwili towarzyszy jej w dalszej wynurówce. Decyduje się również nadać urządzeniu nowe imię. Pamiętamy, prawda? Luna. Szukając ostatniego członka załogi doktora Górskiego, czy tam Gorskiego, Jasna wykorzystuje detektor metalu, żeby śledzić podziemne struktury. Lądownik wraca z powrotem na Waszkę. Na jego pokładzie jest Arti i zabezpieczeni członkowie załogi. Jasna rozmawia z Nowikiem o przyszłości cybernetyki w systemach automa autonomicznych dostrzega możliwości rozwoju i dobrobytu. Według niej roboty staną się z czasem równi ludziom. Obie tylko nas wzorem Skynetu nie wytępili, nie? Staying on the topic of biological analogies, which in itself is already a major scientific distortion. Yes, yes, I understand. These are not real plants. But if they were plants, those protruding parts climbing up, they would serve to obtain energy, mainly solar. Okay, gra wrzuciła nas na początek misji odszukania górskiego. Także kawałek musiałem przem przejść. A jeżeli mam nadzieję tego nie wyciąć, tego jednego kawałka, to przed chwilą mieliśmy ostatni, e, ostatnią rozmowę, którą poprzednio chyba pominąłem przypadkowo, dotyczącą e, próby trafienia, czym tak w zasadzie są te czarne krzaki. Nazwaliśmy je jako system pozyskiwania energii. Czy tak jest? Nie wiem. Natomiast dzisiaj kontynuujemy miejsce, gdzie faktycznie zakończyliśmy ostatnio. Astrogator, Gorski jest nie tutaj. Jestem pewien, że kontynuował się eksplorować. I jeśli poszedł, gdzie myślę, że zrobił, to może zrobić kontakt z kamp, jak i z Dragonfly. Więc myślę, że może zrobić kontakt z nami. Możliwe. Ale jest tylko jedna sposób, żeby być pewien. To jest twoja decyzja, panie. Okay, don't touch him. That's the unwritten rule, isn't it? Under no circumstances do we leave anyone behind. That's right, Doctor. You can lose everything else, but you have to have the crew on board, the living and the dead. This is one of the most crucial imperatives, even though it's not in the regulations. Tu wygląda jakby była jakaś większa struktura, może głębiej sięgająca. W każdym razie wchodzimy. Lokalizator milczy. Ale sobie pooglądamy widoki. The line's breaking up, but I understood. I'll let you know, sir, when I come out of the tunnel. Ok, ale mieliśmy tego nie dotykać, nie? A chyba nie mam wyjścia za bardzo. Ok, jasna. Ok, jesteśmy w momencie widzę lądowania na planetę, zaraz po tym, no właśnie, zaraz zobaczymy dlaczego myśmy się rozbili i dlaczego utraciliśmy pamięć, nie? Ok, 
Roger that. Console has... All systems work. Okay. Ok, lądowanie wygląda na to, że poszło pomyślnie. Ok, no to wychodzimy z komaru. O, automatic. I'm going outside. Visibility? 100%. The dust has already settled. Ok. I've located the second lander. Our people are still on this planet. Ah, very good. I was afraid they might try to fly off. Which wouldn't be the best idea given the loss of communication with Dragonfly. Sir, something's wrong. What is it? The hatch is half open. Did they report hydraulics failure? How should I know? You were the last person in contact with the crew, Doctor. Right. Okay, to wybijamy. Co tu się wydarzyło? I'm inside. And? How is it? Już oglądamy, po uleku. Even if they wanted to, they couldn't go back to Dragonfly. Their lander looks damaged, to put it mildly. Or more accurately, it, it seems like a storm has passed through it. Understood. I mean, I don't understand how it happened. But that means... Hopper is the only vehicle that can take us home. Affirmative. Right. But then we can't afford another mistake. I'm taking the lander into orbit. I'll send it directly to the camp as soon as we find a suitable landing zone. Okay. We've gotten out of worse than this. Equipment breaks from time to time, that's normal. But now... Go ahead. What's bothering you? This lack of communication. It takes too long. Especially considering there's a cyberneticist amongst them. Yes. It worries me too. Nie mogę nic przeklikać? Nie, nie. Tylko są informacje. Okej. Okay. W takim razie chyba stąd wszystko. Faktycznie wszystko przypalone w wodę, nie? I okopcone, okopcona izolacja. Dobrze, smykamy z tego interesu. Brawo ty. Podobają mi się te formacje skalne. Kurczę, ładne, ładnie, ładnie to wygląda. Z tą planetą pięknie. My legs feel really heavy. Give yourself a moment to rest, doctor. You certainly deserve it. Teraz sobie zobaczcie, nie? Tutaj, gdzie mamy ciemno, powiedzmy, jest taka ładna zielona łuna, turkusowa w sumie, a tutaj czerwony karzeł. Damn, you were right, Cobble. Tak jest. Pięknie. Dobrze, idziemy dalej. Nie traćmy czasu, bo nie wiemy ile zostało temu słońcu zanim nas pochłonie. Czyli to tak są pewnie tysiące lat, tam setki tysięcy lat, nie? No ale dzieje się. Jest czysty. Nie pokazuję. Chyba musimy tam iść, co? Wow. 
an object in sight. Okay. This is where they searched the ocean's biosynosis. Meaning, oh, where they caught that fish, right? Mm, yeah. They stopped here first, then walked along the coastline northward. Correct. But I think you might consider taking a shortcut towards the east, straight to the camp. Czyli tam, tak? Copy that. Heading east. Tu. Nie. Czekajcie, no. Obóz tutaj, ok, czyli w tym kierunku, czyli tu, w kierunku planety, ok. I to let's go. Okay, coś tu mamy. <laughs> Musiała to powiedzieć. Compared to this, the damage of an already extinct ecosystem is basically a negligible issue. Okay, to takie rzeczy to nie myślałem w zasadzie. Myślę, że obie kwestie są ważne. Security procedures exist for humans. The rule of integrity is for the sake of everything alien to us. We shouldn't place one above the other. You say yes. The mission and the safety of our people have the highest priority, always. Always? Are we really that self-righteous? Of course, Doctor. We must be the most important to ourselves. And they must be the most important to themselves. Whoever they will be. In the end, the strongest will survive. Isn't that how evolution works? Not in a biological sense, Astrogator. Besides, I'm not convinced if we should interfere with everything alien to us just because we can. Doctor, interference is at the heart of human nature. Man would still be a monkey if he'd only looked at trees instead of cutting them down. Yes, we have a nasty nature. I can't argue with that. No, to idziemy dalej. Chyba tam, co? Lokalizator nadal cisza. Brak obcych struktur. Ile godziny? Masakra, głodny jestem. Jak się jasna postara, to dojdzie szybciej. Twoją drogą ciekawe, czy zaraz wyjaśni, co się wydarzyło jej, nie? O. Jest i woda. Brakuje fala. Co to ma znaczyć? Okej, okay, docieramy do miejsca, gdzie znowu mamy te krzaki czarne. 
Nie mogę wyjść za kwiatu, jak to ładnie jest zrobione. Kurczę. Artificial plants? Is spontaneous growth possible with this type of structure? Oh, I've never seen anything like this. I wish I had time to run some tests. When the situation is stabilized, we will take samples. I promise. Faktycznie metalowa, bo zresztą już widzieliśmy wcześniej, nie, że nasz czujnik metali na to mocno reaguje, nie? Widzicie? Ok, bijemy dalej. Okej, okay, to mi się nie podoba teraz. przeszło jej, ale słychać mocne bicie serca. Wróciliśmy, chyba znalazłem pewną nieścisłość, albo się mylę. Bo on, jak tutaj dochodziliśmy, on się pyta, żeby ona opisała mu te krzaki. Ale czy wcześniej była mowa o tym, że już się z tym spotkali wcześniej? Kurczę, musiałbym zobaczyć drugi śnieg jeszcze raz. Idziemy dalej. Szukamy Górskiego. Co tu było? Are you there? Over. I guess that's a no. Cześć, Luna. No wiek, nie przeklinaj. What's going on, sir? Astrogator? No, please. Koval? Dr. Krauter. How? There was nothing wrong with him. Hypovolemic shock. He bled out during the flight. I still don't understand. He wasn't hurt. His injuries must have occurred later. I found him like this when I entered Hopper. I I'm sorry. It's on me. It's it's my fault. No, Doctor. As Commander, I take full responsibility. But it was me that left him. On my order. You're too hard on yourself, as usual. If only I... Stop it, really. Please, stop. If is a very cruel word. You don't deserve its torment. Okay. I confirm. Gorski was here. His rope is still hanging from the slope. That's a good sign. Whoa. He left it, he intends to come back this way. <sighs> but why hasn't he yet? Okay, do tego tylko nie sięga. Lokalizator to cię pokazuje. Widzicie to? Guess I know where Gorski was going. To idziemy. Tylko jak? Jak ja to mam zejść? Tak, o, tak od ciebie? Szkoda mi twojego zdrowia. Aha, tu jest rączka. Nie widziałem jej wcześniej. Hmm. Ok, 
Czekaj, ja mogę chwilę poczekać, nie? Ale ma chwilę pan głowę. Nie no, wiadomo, że kask, nie? Hełm. I'm stuck. I'm hanging with all my weight on the rope, away from the wall. There's still a fair few meters left to the ground. Can you go back? Using just my hands, strapped with all this extra weight? No, not a chance. What if you sway? Problem. No good. I can't reach anything. Uh, any other ideas? Tak, mam pomysł. Luna, pomóż mi. I can just jump off. Is that safe? A substantial fall on unsteady ground. This is hardly a maneuver that I would describe as safe. So let's take a moment to analyze the situation. I'm thinking if Gorski went down this way and didn't break anything. Yeah, we don't know that, Yasna. He could keep going even with injuries. <sighs> All right, so do you have another idea? Oh, will I be hanging like this until the end of time itself? There is a certain possibility, or rather uncertain, but maybe it's worth trying. I'm listening. Swapie się lundy. Nie. A przecież. Yes. It's flying near me. Good. If I instructed it to fly as close as possible to you, you could grab onto it. Are you sure it will hold me? That I cannot guarantee. All right, let's give it a try. I'm entering the instruction. You must guide me. Hmm. Powiedzmy dwa metry, nie? Two meters forward. Stop, that's enough. You have a really good eye. Exactly two meters. You could say so. I fell from a lower height. It was a soft landing, though. Okay, udało się. Dziękuję, Luna. A my kontynuujemy poszukiwania. Aż chcę to sprawdzić, nie? No, ale tak jakoś słabo, jeśli chodzi o, o wskazywanie tego czegoś. Except they don't look like creations of nature anymore. Uh, maybe that's why Dr. Gorski, not to mention the Alliance. Well, if we're looking for something on this planet, this could be it. These structures form entire multi-story complexes. They look like a city. Are you saying that... No, no. There's no point in jumping to conclusions yet. Left or right? Powoli, powoli. Jest flaga, no właśnie. Tam też coś było. Doktor Gorski set up the flags. Sir, he kept going, despite the lack of communication with the rest. You'd have to see it with your own eyes, sir. Are you receiving a signal? What signal? From Doktor Gorski. No, no. Why are you asking? He tried to open up a connection. Set up a transmitter. 
There's nothing on the comms. But I'll check the record history. Please give me a moment. The height of the entire complex is over 100 meters, even 150. And all made of this metal? To a significant degree. Is something were to live here? Yes. It would have to be very small, like insects. On the other hand, there's no floor around to support such organisms. Okay, okay. Have you chosen where to go? I'm still wondering. There's no time to hesitate, Doctor. We need to take decisive action. All right. I'll squeeze through the passage. <sighs> Two more hours. Huh? That's all Gorski has left of oxygen, at best. And at worst? He's just finishing it up. Though it all depends on his activity. If I remember correctly, there is a risk of methane poisoning. That's right. According to Dr. Crowter, negative symptoms can appear after an hour. Maybe after a few hours. I think you'll find Gorski by then. Let's hope so. These constructions don't have a clear division into functions. They're huge, complicated, and uniform at the same time. Do you have any idea where all this could have come from? I'm aware without tests you can't do much. But let's say on first inspection. It's hard for me to imagine that any biological forms could survive here. The interiors of these structures are filled to the brim with wires and rods. So maybe this metal builds up somehow, by itself. Oh, you've already said something similar before. Just after landing, when you found those bushes. Oh, właśnie, yeah. teraz. Right. Oh, I've already been there. Um, I can't tell if any of this could be part of a machine. Really wish we found Gorski already. Okay. Ah, I see the probe. Has it found anything? It's not making any measurements at the moment. Oh, why? The overload protection is activated. Until I do a reset, it's on manual control. Mm. Oh, is it because of my flight? It's possible, but please don't worry about it. What matters is that you're fine. The security system seems quite flawed. It's not a defect, Doctor. It's a feature. Wouldn't it be better if I helped you? I can close it manually, after all. I need some direction. I'd bring it to you. No problem. I'm on it. First, let's find a place where I can land it. Otherwise, you won't be able to help me, Doctor. No, to zaraz znajdziemy. Mogę być tutaj. No właśnie. There. I found the right place. All right then. I'm waiting for instructions. Let's see. Obrócę. Po nie wiem o ile. Na razie stoję się gdzieś. Please rotate the probe 180 degrees. O, bardzo ładnie. Ten meters forward. Ach, mogę jeszcze ją obrócić, nie? Eee, ha, 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 15 wystarczy. 
turn 15 degrees to the right and 5 meters forward. Prawie, no? Two more meters to the right. No i bardzo ładnie. Okay. How's the terrain? The structures. Are they still everywhere? Oh, you're sure. Yep. Wherever I look, there's metal. Don't be angry. It's not anger. It's a warning sign. I know, I know. You're welcome, Luna. No, bravo, te. A my idziemy dalej. Tak? Luna, okay? Okay. No to śmigamy. Oj, obrócił dobrze, dziewczyno. It's a bit like Pando. In what? I have no idea what you're talking about, Doctor. A, a colony of populous tremoloids. American aspen. The new trees grow not from seeds, but from root suckers of old trees. As a result, it's one giant organism, thousands of years old. So you're in a dead metal forest. Huh, that does sound bizarre. So maybe. Doctor, something has been recorded up for, but there are plenty of errors in the transmission header. It's hard to say whether this is a message from Gorski. Well then, sir, play it. Maybe we'll finally find out what's going on with the Doctor. Let's hope so. Okay. Gorski to base. So far, it all leads to one conclusion. This is not a place for a man, nor for any humanoids. Then who is it for? Maybe it's really an alien technology. Those Lyrans. Uh, as far as I know, all information about the Lyran civilization is just guesswork. Many consider Lyrans to be just a myth, so I wouldn't take it too seriously. I think there might be something to it. I can see the relay up close. It looks broken. Well, it could be just a coincidence, especially since the relays are quite delicate. I don't know, Doctor. Weeks of diversion to me.
Okej, okay, tego nie można przeklikać, szkoda. Ale zostawił swoje rzeczy, nie? Okej, okay, idziemy dalej. W takim razie to chyba nie, co? Chociaż to wygląda na dalszą drogę, ale pierwszy chcę zobaczyć tamtą szczelinę jeszcze, bo to też wygląda ciekawie. Chodź, Luna. Zobaczmy to miasto. No wow. There are more traces. This time handprints and a drop detector. What? Did I hear you right? Yes, sir. You heard correctly. I'm afraid we must be ready for any eventuality. Well, that doesn't mean we should assume the worst. I still believe you'll find him, Doctor. Jak to wygląda na mapie? Tu wbijamy. Mhm. Tu jest flaga. Tu trzeba bym się teraz wrócił jeszcze. Chociaż tu wygląda na koniec drogi, tak jakby. Brak przejścia. Ok. Luna. Okej, okay, bo to wygląda na. I found something. Again. I'm listening. I suspect Gorski might have damaged his suit. If the tear doesn't exceed 20 millimeters, the reactive polymer layers will self-seal. That's true. Nevertheless, it looks worse and worse. I found more of his gear. Back in the camp, you reported Marit's abandoned things. A backpack and a journal, yes. This scene looks disturbingly similar. No one of sound mind would decide to go down this way. And yet Gorski... Ok, i tak widzę, że mamy powrót, bo tu zejścia nie ma. Dobrze, wracamy z powrotem. Wygląda na to, że i tak musimy się wrócić tam wcześniej do flagi. Chyba, że tu coś. Luna? Nie! Nie, ja chciałem jeszcze wrócić. No i widzicie, trzeba było od razu iść z powrotem tam do tej flagi, a teraz się już chyba nie wrócę, co? Luna? Tędy nie wskoczy z powrotem? Nie, nie pozwoli mi gra. Kurczę, mam nadzieję, że tam nic nie było ciekawego. Luna, już do ciebie idę. Czekajcie. Nie, nie pozwoli mi. Co za hamstwo. <grych> Okej, okay, trudno się mówi. A szkoda. Także na przyszłość pamiętać, jak jest do sprawdzenia, to od razu to sprawdzać, a nie ryzykować. Chodź, Luna. Te graty jego leżą, nie? No właśnie. Ok. Gdzieś tam, tu jest szczelina, spoko. Are you here? It's me, Jasna. Still nothing. Yeah. Uh, 
I found his backpack. You know what that means, sir? Yes, he's without oxygen. We must hurry. Oh, there he is. I see him. He's lying in a sinkhole. Doctor, answer me, please. Got him. He's not moving. Oddycha. Mm -hmm. Gorski! Gorski! Look at me! His eyes are closed. Is he breathing? He's alive, but barely. Did he react in any way? No reaction. He seems unconscious. Gorski! Come on! Calm down, Doctor. Get him out of there. The probe's already looking for a landing site. Okay. Let me just... I'm... I'm pulling him... Out. Done. He's out. I activated his SOS. You should pick up a transmission with his parameters, sir. Well? No, nothing. The transmitter in the suit must be too weak. Should I retrieve his booster from the backpack? No, no point. Better to set up a relay. We have to do it anyway so that Hopper can land in this maze. Okay. Have a preliminary scan of your surroundings. There's an open area nearby. You have to move Gorski there. The probe will guide you. But he's not stable. I must share my oxygen with him, Astrogator. You'd need a spare for that. The protocol doesn't provide for connecting two suits at the same time. In that case, I'll give him my tank. Negative. I won't allow it, Yasna. If you faint, the doctor won't carry you. The membrane looks intact. What did you say? I didn't hear. Hold on, Gorski. I still can't hear you, Doctor. Please repeat. Don't be angry, sir. But... But what? Please go ahead. After... Con after careful consideration, I gave Gorski my tank. We still don't know when you'll send the lander, so I, I can't leave him without oxygen. Doctor, I explicitly <laughs> told you not to. Never mind. Let's hope Artie can finish the job if you're both unconscious. <sighs> Damy radę, jasna jest twarda dziewczyna. Wow. Are you out in the open already? Sort of. Yes. Once you set up the transmitter, I should start receiving calls. Obojętnie gdzie? Tutaj, ok.
that. I'm so great, uh, I, I, I'm underground. It's hard to determine my exact location. Novik, do you copy? Base, come in. I'm sending an SOS. Anyone, please. Okay. Stay calm. Just keep it together. Heartbeats racing. Okay, a więc zostaliśmy sami. Także moi drodzy, tutaj przerwiemy naszą przygodę. W kolejnym odcinku kontynuujemy już przygodę w niewiadomym położeniu. Także dziękuję Wam serdecznie za trwanie do końca. Jeśli się spodobało, skorzystacie jeszcze raz za, za subskrybuj, za lajku, zapisz komentarz, zawitaj ponownie. Trzymajcie się zdrowo. Do następnego. Hej.